Hey, what's up everybody? This is a toilet seat replacement. I'm going to be replacing this wooden elongated seat with a um, just a general toilet seat. Um, so first, what you want to do is take a couple measurements and see what kind of seat you have. You either have an elongated or a round one. This one you could tell it's kind of like an oval shaped, not like a straight circle. This is what they mean. It says elongated right here. And then the seat kind of just looks like how it, how it does right here. <clears throat> and what you want to do is measure from the bolt hole on your current seat. And then measure to the front of the bottom seat. Because it sticks out a little further than the, than the lid. And then that will give you your measurement. And then you can know which one to order. Um, most of the time it's just going to be you either have elongated or you have a round, a round one. Now this one's cool because when you get the box you can actually put it on top of your toilet to make sure it's going to fit before you even open the box. I'm going to link this one in the uh, description. It was like 20 bucks. It's just like a very good general just seat replacement. Here's the difference between elongated and round and where you measure them. And then that will give you your measurement. So here's what it looks like when it comes out. Uh, I'm going to recommend this one. It's a pretty good brand. It's super easy to install and it's inexpensive. So it even comes with instructions. And um, so what you want to do is your current seat might have little lids uh, on the bolt hole covers that you lift up to unscrew it. This one doesn't. These ones unscrew from the bottom. So if you come near the bottom, um, you want to come down here and you're going to have something like this or maybe something like this, like a, like a wing nut. But this one is just like a, a, a plastic um, kind of like a bolt nut thing going on here. So I'm just going to use my pliers. You could use a socket, a wrench, whatever you got to unscrew whatever kind of thing you got on the bottom here. It might just be like a hand tighten one. Um, so I'm going to go ahead and undo this. And then um, you're going to have to do this for both sides depending on whatever kind of setup you have. But um, yeah, do this side and then do this side over here like that. Okay. And then once those are out, we are going to just, with two hands, just gently lift this up. Kind of, You can kind of wiggle it and pull it up. This one's like a wooden one. It's kind of heavy. Um, so, you know, but uh, if it has any kind of like hardware left in the in the seat, or the bowl, I mean, then you want to get rid of it. So it's just, just like that. Just, you know, new. Now, my new one comes with the flaps on the top. And you're going to have to open the flaps up. You just kind of just push them up with your fingers and then they come up. And the hardware comes with is two things. It comes with uh, a plastic nut, um, oh, and these seat these seat bumpers. These just you just push them in on the toilet seat on the bottom. They they go in pretty easy, and that's it. That's all I gotta do for these. Uh, very simple set here. Then you'll line this up, and then what we're gonna do is line these holes up here, and then with with these lined up, we will put the bolts through, just like that. All right, and then from the bottom, we're going to take this plastic, um, like, twist nut, and then we're going to just get it started on the bolt on the bottom. You just put the nut right in the middle of this, and then just twist this until it starts to climb up the bolt, like this. And you don't have to do this until it, um, until it gets all the way up there. Just get it to where it starts getting resistant, and then this long uh, tab on the side will kind of bottom out on the, on the toilet bowl. And then from there, we're going to um, use a screwdriver. Do that on both sides, of course. And then from there, we're going to use a screwdriver to manually tighten it from the top. And then this will, uh, you know, make everything snug and tight so nothing's moving around or nothing like that. We'll do that for both sides. And then um, just make sure, you know, your toilet seat's lining up right. And then that's pretty much it. Got that on. And then we can just, once it's tight, we can close these lids. And if you ever need to open these to tighten it more, you can. It's not a big deal. And that's it, guys. So, hope this video helped you out. I recommend this one. It's 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 like a hard plastic, but it's a good quality one. It has the bumpers. It's quiet when you shut it. Um, so, thanks for watching. All right, guys. That's all the information I got for you. The rest of the video is just a couple products and other stuff I got going on. Totally up to you if you want to stick around. I got a 15% off promo code for oxido led headlights these are the best headlights in my opinion they just recently upgraded all their technology so their led lights are even brighter than the others that are still using old tech um i've had many led lights uh, as far as like headlights interior lights whatever brake lights and these are the best they don't flicker they're not cheap 
they don't like go out on you um, all you gotta do is go to the oxido website type in your vehicle information then look up what kind of light you want all their products will pop up and uh, these are available on Amazon as well, but if you go to the website and use Guillermo Auto in the in the truck in the discount code spot, you will get 15% off. So if you're looking for new brighter upgrades, check these out. Hey, what's up guys? I want to tell you about Quantum Soap. It's a new men's soap company. They got many, many different bars of soap, each with their own ingredients and fragrance and texture. They even have grittier bars for like mechanics or whoever, like the dark matter bar, it's extra gritty. Um, if you go to their website, it's free shipping over $50. Each bar is about $5. You also get a 10% discount code for your first order. Um, they're coming out with many new soaps. It's definitely worth checking out. Of course, I have a discount code for you. It's uh, Guillermo Auto. If you type it in at checkout, you'll get 10% off. You could use it as many times as you want every time you order. These make great gifts to uh, husbands, boyfriends, uncles, nephews. Uh, they even got the Galactic Mechanic Bar. It's super gritty for mechanics, so check that out. Type in the Guillermo Auto promo code. That way they know you're one of the homies. And uh, that's it, guys.